everybody Ann here just sitting here in the tiny house having my coffee with all you still working on that recipe book on my laptop it's taking forever I had I had started it years ago and I had started doing it on Linux and I used I can't remember the name of the the word processing program that I used but it's a little different than the Windows one so I'm having to go back and reformat and everything using Windows because my Linux install is shot. I haven't updated it in so long. When I try and boot up to it, it gives me an error message. And um, so what I need to do is press this little button, get into this editing environment thing, and then get a really good internet connection and download all the updates before I can use it again. So I'm kind of bummed about that, but I just keep moving on with Windows. So that's taking forever to do. I uploaded one copy and unfortunately it was the copy that was saved to my hard drive and I accidentally saved the new copy to my drive so I have to go back and upload that all again it takes so long and um, you know I have to kind of review it preview it and make sure that it looks right all the formatting is good and right now it's not quite in the pocket but it'll get there anyhow today's video is going to be me sharing with you a few channels on YouTube that I just really love and you may have heard of a few of them, you may have heard of all of them, but all of these videos are ones that I haven't really mentioned in the past. Um, they're, this is not an exhaustive list of my you know, favorite um, videos on YouTube. But I thought I'd share these with you, so I hope you enjoy them. I'm going to put their links down below, so I hope you will go and watch their videos, subscribe. They're very worthwhile. They have good, positive attitudes. They've got uh, lots of great information and very supportive of the viewers and encouraging and whatnot. So here, let's get started. The first channel that I want to share with you is Luke Fugit. This dude can do anything. He rebuilds vehicles, as you can see he's doing here. He knows everything about solar. He knows about wind generator power, water generator power. He built this beautiful schoolie, school bus uh, RV, and that's kind of when I started watching him. But he literally knows how to do everything. Here he is pulling the truck bed off of a beat up old truck that he bought, and here it is showing the inside of it. You can see daylight through some of those places in there. And when he, I first started watching these videos of him restoring this truck, I thought, Luke, you are out of your mind. You are crazy. He goes all around the frame and shows different areas where there's basically holes and whatnot. And believe it or not, guys, well, I'm not going to tell you the ending of it, but he just really amazed me, surprised the heck out of me. So please go watch him. He's Luke Fugit. And the next one is, oh, this one. I started watching her at the recommendation of one of my subscribers. This channel's name is uh, Appalachia's Homestead with Patara. This woman is absolutely delightful. She has a beautiful spirit, and she's funny, and she sings like a bird, like an angel. She has lots of tips for homesteaders on growing, planting, and she's also very encouraging and real. She shows, you know, like her weeds and whatnot. Makes me feel not so bad. And oh, here, this, this video tickled me. She had moved, and the mover people came, and she had this hen outdoors. And uh, so this mama hen relocated all of her chicks and eggs and whatnot. So Patara had to go around and try and chase them all down and get them all together. You should go watch the video. It's hilarious and she's doing this all in the, the dead of summer in the heat. You can see a little droplet coming off her nose, but she's very encouraging and wonderful, so please go watch her. The next one I'm sure that you guys are all familiar with. This is Papa Pepper. I've been watching his channel for a very long time. I started watching his channel, oh, I don't know how long ago it was. I was still living in my apartment, and I love to grow peppers. I love to grow all kinds of things. And he has a wealth of knowledge on growing things. He's also, um, he knows lots about wildlife and snakes, which I hate. He has so much courage around snakes. He's a snake wrangler, basically. So he has a lot of great information. 
and he's got a beautiful family. I love it when I see his wife and kids in the videos. It is just so cool, and they are all so well behaved and delightful to watch. But this guy, you can bet your you know what that if he says something about growing or planting or homesteading, farming, any of that kind of stuff, you can be guaranteed that he's telling you the truth. So this is Papa Pepper. I know many of you already know about him, but if you don't, please go watch his channel. And another homesteading channel that I really love watching is Wholesome Roots. She is one of the first channels I started watching, aside from Bobblehead, and I remember the series she did when she had a bunch of goats and she had that one really fragile one. What's the goat's name? Was it Autumn? And she nursed that thing like crazy and brought it to health. Well, she's had a baby recently, and this photo is of her basically with the baby strapped on, hauling hay in the blazing heat, and look how she instinctively cradles that little baby's head when she starts to kind of lean over. But she has lots of information on... Well, planting and growing, in this video she was talking about um, tomato suckers and whatnot and what to do with them and when to harvest them, when not to harvest them. But uh, she knows all about chickens and quail. She's got me interested in quail and goats and growing and basically anything you need to know for the homestead, this lady is going to be able to tell you and she's just delightful. I just love watching her. She's got a great attitude, so please go watch her. And, uh, oh, this next one, Primitive Technology. I started watching him years ago, too. Right after he had put out his first or second video, this guy lives in Australia, and he uses only primitive tools, and he makes primitive things. Uh, there he made a pot out of wood ash, and he builds primitive structures. He's built f different forges. He makes bricks and, oh, just all kinds of different things, and he uses materials that he finds from the land that surrounds him. And here I think that a forge he was making um, and see that little stick thing he does that to start all of his fires it is truly amazing and watching his videos is a very very relaxing experience because you don't hear anybody blabbing like me all the time it's just him out in the woods with the sounds of nature and you get to watch him just do things just doing cool cool things so I've learned an awful lot from this channel please go watch him it's primitive technology and you won't be disappointed okay this next channel solar cabin I've watched him for so long I just can't even remember how long he stopped making videos for a little while there but now he's back here he is sitting in his hot tub that he made so he's got a couple videos about that hot tub it's hilarious and he knows everything about solar he also builds things he um, creates building plans for tiny houses um, different sorts of trailers and whatnot I don't know know the names for all of them but this guy is a true expert so if you're interested in off-grid living solar power he also does reviews of products that are related to uh, you know what we need for off-grid so please go watch his channel subscribe and you won't be disappointed well those are just a few of my favorite places on the internet I hope you guys enjoyed them and go and watch their videos, subscribe, leave comments and whatnot. I don't think you're going to be sorry. I've watched all of these channels for a really, really long time. And they keep putting out quality content. I think that you can count on the fact that they're still going to be here in a few months making more videos. And uh, each of them have unique takes on different things, you know, about you know, homesteading, planting, growing, or solar, off-grid living, that sort of thing. So I may do a few more of these shout-out videos in the future. Um, the channels that I shout-out are going to be ones that I've watched for a while and who are consistently making videos and who I'm pretty sure are going to be around for a while and, you know, not just make a couple videos and then quit, you know, um, because making videos is hard. It's a lot of work. Anyhow, I'm starting to sweat. i got to get, get in front of a fan. i got to go finish that uh, recipe book. And uh, so I can get that out there so you can all rush to buy it. <laughs> anyway, that's all I got for you guys. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.